All right, today I'm showcasing Kiora, uh, featuring the School of the Wizard, which I think is just a boon to pretty much all blue decks. I'm sure there's some exception, but you guys get it. So Kiora gives you a fish at the start, which is a zero one blocker. So that's good for stabilizing. On turns 10, 15, and 20, you get a Leviathan. You can read their effects here. School of the Wizard, the first card you play, or the first card that goes in the top three of your deck is the 1-1 one, one Familiar. When it debuts, it reduces the cost of a random spell in your hand by two. The next one is draft a signature spell and add it to your hand. And then the next one for the rest of the game, at the end of each turn, you spend six or more mana on spells, summon a water elemental, which is a 5-5 five, five with sneak. So it allows you to have uh, more threat density without giving up so much space in the deck for threats. So we run the crab, stop the aggression. We run the birds of paradise to um, obviously ramp faster um, and get to 10, 15, and 20. This is a flex spot right now. Um, I enjoy it. I think it's I think it's decent enough. It could very easily be a million other things. It's it's just in here, just testing it to see how good it actually is. Um, Scepter, draft, uh, draft, a, uh, draft a spell that costs two or less and add it to your hand, so just a fantastic card. Panharmonicon is amazing. Um, activate trigger the debut of a creature you summon this turn, so it's incredibly powerful in this deck. Um, all the artifacts cost one less, by the way, and on turn five you have a chance of decreasing it by one, so that only costs two, Scepter only costs one. Figment, if you drafted that turn, it costs zero, still a good card. Elite Forest Guard on debut, draft a naturalize, a plummet, or a nuzzle so that either for one mana destroys an enemy artifact, two destroy an enemy creature with flying, or one fully heal a creature. So with this, you can get it off twice. So if they're spamming flyers or they're spamming artifacts, that can be a really strong combo. Cure's Tide Shaper, debut add an empty mana gem. So if you play this on two, you can play Tide Shaper on three and ramp twice, which is pretty good. Shell games just get removal. Mystic Tome. Cost three in this deck, draw a card. I'm still opting this over the wizard spell book. I think that it costs one less is actually significant. It only gets you one less card over the card's lifetime, but it allows you to dig earlier if you need a specific answer. Sylvan Shrine only costs three in this deck. Get an empty mana gem, two charges. Drag under, just another good piece of removal that you need because these this color scheme is light on removal. Master Possibilities is crazy good. Um, debut draft a temporary spell that costs six or less, changes cost to zero, and add it to your hand. So combined with this, it's just um, gets you a lot, gets you out of a lot of situations. And especially since you're ramping in this deck, you can play this card on turn four, turn five, and it's just really, really strong. Plot is our way of triggering the Elemental Mastery to get the five-five sneak. For, you know, by playing one card, drawing two cards, getting two empty mana gems is exactly what this deck wants to do. Also, with the element, with the familiar, um, if you like, let's say that's the only spell in your hand, you can drop down to four, which is really powerful. Uh, let's see, and then Arcanist Archmage puts a mystical arcana into your deck. They're all five cost spells, give off random creature sneak, gain control of an enemy creature, summon three Skymaster Sphinxes. So just multiple win cons in this one card, and also he's almost getting you all the way to being able to trigger Elemental Mastery. So if you combine that with any other spell in the deck, like one of the removal spells, or like one of the spells you get from the Scepter, then you're in good shape. Um, this could easily be the Lore Keeper because it adds another spell, which could then help with Elemental Mastery. Like I said, I'm just testing it to see if it's worth it, because whenever it gives something like this another charge, that's pretty strong. You can give this another charge to draw a card. Um, even giving Scepter another charge is pretty good, but overall I enjoyed the deck. I thought it was solid I hope you guys enjoy the games. Thanks for watching Kiara versus Alaska. Okay, this should be interesting as long as they don't run um, Epitome of Might, then we should be okay. And I think most Raska decks don't. It's just the weird ones that I make do. So. Um, I'm gonna keep the pigment and hope I get something that drafts. Game 
gaze upon me and despair. Hello, little friend. Seek knowledge. Fragile Mana Gem, just summon the crab. Um. And there's not a spell in my hand, but. A fellow seeker. I'd rather just get it going. And then also, whenever I get that spell, then I can play this for free. Yeah, if you want to play with it, I will happily block. Absolutely. I'm not worried about fatal infections. They take time to play. Especially if he uses one on a fish. Um, yeah, and here we go. I'll take turn the stone all day long. Boundless potential. Play this. Interesting. Okay, so. Cards. Yeah, I'll take that card. Um, yeah, I still don't think it's worth it to give up the Fragile Mana Gem. That's unfortunate. Could be worse. Okay, now. Have you tried turning it off and on again? That's what I wanted. I don't think it's worth it playing the bird just to block a 2-2. I mean, you could remove this and then swing for 10, but... Heads up! Had a feeling. Death is a part of life. I think I have 
to. Time for a field test. <laughs> Kills a flyer, artifact, or fully heal a creature. None of which are particularly good. Was really hoping for a master of possibilities there. Have you tried turning it off and on again? Pick your poison! I'd rather give them to infant manage and have them go in place. You don't die in vain. Not fantastic places. I had something for an enemy artifact now. <laughs> if I was in, I would just take it. <laughs> see a reason to Good do anything else. If I do play two of these in a turn, I will get the sneak guy, which is nice. like to get to 15, but, you know. Alright. I have seen unimaginable things.
take the stun just to not worry about anything. And then give both my things sneak and hopefully I can just win like that. stabilizing. That was a pretty cool game one. This has an island, which is kind of scary. I will take all the ramp, please. Hello, Thank you. I'm gonna play this Let's into this, most mind. likely. Seek Try and ramp twice. I love Wizard's class, it's so cool. Okay, this is gonna be like the rampiest game I've ever played. about negate now. Remand would be obnoxious. How refreshing. Okay, I think that was worth. Next turn, it's probably going to be two. Maybe this, I don't know. I've got a plan. Let's see what I draw first before I make my decisions. Oh, I know I'm doing this no matter what, so. Hmm. Yeah, I don't want to give up an artifact, so. Seeker. It's wild that I'll be at nine mana <gasps> gems next turn. Yeah, we can clear up some space here. Slow me down a little bit. I've been ramping too much, it makes sense. Okay, so he probably has remand, right? Like there's no way he doesn't. So I'm just not gonna get my turn for no reason. Pick your poison! Destroy an artifact. I'm actually just gonna do it twice. That's fine. 
I'm hoping it was that end remand and not just uh, just that. Second color is red. I brought back up. Potential. I'm gonna hold off on plots until I play that most likely, right? Yeah, let's just make that effective. I mean I still have another one, so why not? Should have taken those plummets, huh? Goated. A temporary setback. Well, no, it's not. To actually call the elements. Just play that spell I while up. I don't have to worry about it getting negated. Hopefully it's not too much of a doozy. It's probably gonna be some kind of removal spell for this. Nailed it. Okay, I don't want that coming back or blinking or I don't know anything. Just leave the board, please. Thank you. Waiting for like the mill two artifacts, and, uh, tomes, or the scepter, or just something for these to get value on. Like, I never see Jason now on artifacts.
fill our way. Best against this, right? I'm gonna keep the spells in my hand that I don't need to use so I can proc the elemental mastery as much as possible. Especially if he has lava wave, like I suspect. So many possibilities. 13, 15. playing this like I, he's probably just gonna have like he might have some kind of board clear um like the lava wave so i don't want to lose everything i have problem solving is my specialty Seems like a very problem solving is my specialty is he just singularly bouncing everything Got dragged under twice, so. Uh, one man Bad news, Please. friend. Cool. Two games. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you tomorrow.